Hi guys, welcome to Simplify Academy. So in the video, all India civil service coaching center oda entrance exam la kete science and technology related questions kana answers kis na paka porom. So idhi variko na channel subscribe panada nga subscribe panirenga. Idhi vandu question paper set C. So question number seven, which of the following are potential benefits offered by 5G technology? Uh, number one, uh, low latency and greater download speed. Number two, connecting multiple devices and exchanging data in real time. Number three, improved road safety by allowing vehicles to communicate between themselves. Number four, creating efficient sensors networks to track patients. And number five, increased energy savings. So, the first statement is correct. So, for example, if we check the internet, we will check the speed of the response of the latency. So, the latency is very low for 5G. The download speed is very low. 1 GB is very low for 5G technology. In the first statement, we will check the benefits of 5G. So, the option D is the right answer. Question number 8. In which place India is planning to establish its first dark sky reserve? So, the option is the option B. So, this is where we are at Ladakh. So, question number 9. With reference to ice team, consider the following statements. Statement 1. It is a dynamic and interactive national portal initiated by Ministry of Science and Technology, Government of India. Statement 2. The main objective is to provide support to needy researchers in different ways and to strengthen the R&D ecosystem of the country. So, if you look at the right answer, option B, second only. So, if you look at the first statement, it is right, it's a national portal, but it is initiated by Principal Scientific Advisor. If you look at the Principal Security Advisor or National Security Advisor, that is the Principal Security Advisor. Initiate the initiative of the ICE team. So, question number 91, with reference to INSOCOG, consider the following statement. First statement 1, it is jointly initiated by Union Health Ministry of Health and Indian Council of Medical Research, among others. Statement 2, it is a pan-India network to monitor genomic variations in SARS-CoV-2. Statement 3, it is facilitated by National Center for Disease Control. So, you can write moon statement in the first statement, but the options are the moon statement in the first statement. Because the first statement is that the INSAC is the RL initiate, Union Health Ministry of Health, then the ICMR, as well as CSIR, then the Department of Biotechnology. So, the four pairs are the initiative. So, the first statement is right. And then, Pan-India Network to monitor COVID-19 variations, Junum variations. Institute RMH Changa and the same time with the National Center for Disease Control that is facilitated by the NHK so this is the right statement but there are options C, 2 and 3 only so options are not available but there is an official key that is available with reference to helium consider the following statement statement 1 it is the lightest element on earth statement 2 it is the only element that cannot be solidified by sufficient cooling at normal atmospheric pressure so statement second मर्दा right है first statement पाती है ना lightest element आंधे याद तो आंधे hydrogen है so second statement वन तो दा right है अनाला option B two only the answer question number ninety three the purple revel revolution is associated with cultivation of option A lavender option B blueberry option C mulberry option D coral reefs so answer पाती है ना option A lavender so question number 94, with reference to antimicrobial resistance, consider the following statement. Statement 1, it occurs when bacteria, virus, fungi and parasites no longer respond to medicines. Statement 2, antimicrobial resistant organisms are found in humans only. And statement 3, WHO de has declared that AMR is one of the top 10 global public health threats facing humanity. So, if you can answer option C, 1 and 3 only. Because second statement is that humans are only in. It's not only humans. Food is in the food. Animals are in the food. Antimicrobial resistance is in the food. Question number 95, with reference to Neoco. Consider the following statements. Number 1, it is bad coronavirus that was first identified in 2011. 2, it shares an 85% similarity to MERS-CoV in genome sequencing. Number 3, Infection with Neoco could not be cross-neutralized by antibodies targeting SARS-CoV-2 or MESCO. So, which of the following statements given is our cover? Correct. So, the kind of right answer is option D, 1, 2, 3. So, all of them are correct. Option 96. With reference to small satellite launch vehicle, consider the following statements. Statement 1. News 
Space India Limited under the Department of Space is the sole nodal agency responsible for providing end-to-end -end SSLV launch vehicles. Statement 2. It can carry satellites weighing up to 5000 kg to a lower Earth orbit. Statement 3. It is perfectly suited for launching multiple macro satellites at a time. Which of the statements given above is or correct? So, this is the right answer. Option D, 1 and 3 only. Yeah, I'm going to tell So, SSL will carry the capacity of 500 kilos. So, 500 kilos will carry the lower rate of it. SSL will carry the lower So, next question 97. Consider the following statements regarding rare earth elements. So, uh, number 1. Both light, uh, light rare earth elements and heavy rare earth elements are abundantly found in India. Number 2. India is part of USA led. Minerals Security Partnership Statement 3 uh, Rare earth elements are an essential part of required for manufacturing of batteries used in electric vehicles Third statement right So, so rare earth elements are 17 The 17 is 15 is lanthanide series 57 is start And then the other is scandium Scandium is atomic number 21 Ethereum is 39 So these are the additional elements and uh, the Patina, India is not part of the US led uh, mineral security pas uh, partnership. So, that's the second statement. Up to every uh, rare earth elements on the India la, la, la. option D, three only the correct answer. Question number 98 with reference to Genetic Engineering Appraisal Committee, consider the following statements. One, it is an apex body established under Ministry of Science and Technology for research and industrial production related to biotechnology. Number two, BT cotton and BT brinjal are the only crops permitted for cultivation in India by Genetic Engineering Appraisal Committee. Which of the statements given above is or correct? So, the answer is option D, neither one nor two. Yeah, first one the it is an apex body established under Ministry of Environment and Forest and Climate Change. That's the other one that through the Ganga, not Ministry of Science and Technology. So that's the other one that's BT cotton matuna the other one approval could ganga. That too it's a non food crop. That's not matana the approval. So food crops with the very good approved panel. So question number 99 with reference to human eye, consider the following statements. One, the white part of the eyes is called iris. Number two, uh, Cornea contributes the majority of eyes total focusing power. Which of the statements given above is or correct? So you can answer Patina option B two only. First one the white part of eyes is called ciliria. Okay, so another one the statement. And second pathina cornea the one contribute panel the major focusing power. So around sixty five to seventy percent of focusing power is the recovery pathina cornea are getting the other. So question number hundred. Consider the following statements regarding web three point two. It combines older generation of web tools with cutting edge technology such as AI and blockchain. Statement 2 It establishes a new version of internet protocol incorporating token based economics, transparency, and decentralization. Which of the statements given above is or not correct? So, you can note that it is not correct. So, you can see the correct statement. Web 3.2 is cutting edge technology used to design an internet protocol. So, that is AI and blockchain. So, blockchain is token based economics and transparency and the tree installation automatically. So, that is the option D. Neither one, not two. That is the right answer. So, question 101. With reference to snail fish, consider the following statements. Statement 1. The snail fish releases biofluorescence which allows it to glow in the water. Statement 2. Snail fish are the only polar fish reported to have biofluorescence. So, which of the given statement is or correct? So, if you look at the statement, you can see the correct statements. So, snail fish release biofluorescence. So, this is so, the green land. So, that's why we have the green land. So, that's why we have the green land. Biofluorescence is one of polar fish that we have to sail fish. Matana. So question number 102 with reference to James Webb telescope comparison with other telescopes consider the following statements. So you could compare it Kepler could compare it and then Herschel would compare it So Kepler was first statement one Kepler was designed to wide and shallow survey telescope while Webb is designed to designed for narrow and deep. Statement 2 Web is sensitive to wavelengths from visible light to mid infrared, while Herschel was sensitive to 
with a far infrared wavelength so we are going to write on a statement sum so james webb telescope pathina uh, nasa plus uh, european space agency and canadian space agency id moonoda collaboration la uruvakapatta da and 103 artemis 1 mission recently seen in the news it is related to which of the following so idukana answer pathina na option c moon id the artemis 1 mission yaar amcha patta na nasa amcha kanga which of the following best describes agnikul and sky route which were recently in news so id idukana answer pathina na option b startups developing launch vehicles for smaller payloads so that one the right answer part 5 which what is the case 9 protein that is often mentioned in the news so case 9 adha alladhu crispr case 9 appdi solla solluvanga so idu edhuk use pandranga appadina gene editing la use pandranga so idukana answer pathina option a a molecular scissors used in targeted gene editing so in the video la edha doubt irundha comment section la podunga and in the video um friends ku share pannunga thank you